If you have digital photos in your camera or media cards that you need to transfer to your computer, you have a few options. You can connect your camera or card reader to your computer by using a USB cable. Or if your camera has a docking station, plug it into your computer and place your camera in the dock. And finally, if your computer has a media card slot, insert your card in it. Once your camera is attached to the computer or your media card is in the media slot, you have some choices on how to transfer files onto your machine. If you have Adobe Photoshop Elements installed, the Adobe Photo Downloader may pop up. If it does, you'll see the number of photos found, the hard drive space needed, and some options for the transfer. The default options are recommended, but you can adjust them if you prefer. When you're ready, click Get Photos. Your photos are copied to your hard drive and imported into the Adobe Photoshop Elements Organizer, where you can edit, print, and burn a CD of your photo collection. If you don't have Adobe Photoshop Elements installed or the Adobe Downloader does not pop up, you should see an autoplay screen like this one. Select Import Pictures to copy photos from your camera or media card into the Windows Photo Gallery. Add a tag to help you find and organize photos later. And click Import. Once you see your photos here, they're safely on your computer. You can choose to print, email, or burn photos to a CD or DVD. On a Mac, you see your camera or media card as another drive on the computer. Double-click the icon, and then through the folder structure to find your photos. To copy all of your photos easily, click Edit, select All, then Edit, Copy. Then locate the folder to paste them on your computer and choose Edit, Paste. Your photos are now safely on your Mac hard drive. Now you can delete these photos off of your camera or media card by double-clicking on your camera icon and through to your photos. Choose Edit, Select All, then File, Move to Trash. Then empty the trash by clicking and holding the trash icon and selecting Empty Trash to ensure that your camera or card is clear. Finally, be sure to eject your camera properly by clicking and dragging it to the eject icon. Now you have space to take more photos. For extra insurance, burn a backup CD or DVD of the photos on your hard drive. First, insert a blank disk into your computer's CD or DVD drive. Next, click Burn from the folder you copied your photos into. Type a name for the disk, choose the Mastered option, and click Next. The Burn folder will appear with all of the photos you selected to burn. Click Burn to Disk, give it a title, and click Next. After you burn the CD, put it back into your drive and verify that your photos are on it. Click Start, Computer, and click your CD drive. You should see all of the photos you burned. Be sure to label your disk, and now you can safely delete photos from your media card. To do this, click on the media card. Double-click through to your photos, select your photos, and choose Organize, Delete, and Yes to Delete. Your media card is now clear and ready for more photo taking.